Hello everyone. So today we are back with another case study, and this time it is for the refurbished smartphones. In this video, we will see what are all the tactics and the strategies that we have followed to bring them the revenue of almost three hundred thousand in the month of March with the ROAS of ten point sixty eight. When our client came to us, they were running some campaigns with their previous digital marketing agency, but the ROI was not there. They were having the revenue of almost four thousand dollars in one month, with the ROI of almost two or three. So we have then devised them a strategy wherein we have tried to focus on specific type of products in separate campaigns. By doing that, we have been able to control the budget for those high spending or high selling campaigns. So once we have done the audit of their Google AdWords account, we have seen the type of keywords that they were using and the quality of the clicks that they were getting. The thing is, they were using the broad match keywords. So now, when we use the broad match keyword, we can expect the quality of the clicks to be very low. So we have done the competitor benchmarking. We have seen what keywords our competitors are using, and then we have chosen the relevant ones. Then we have used those keywords in the Google Keyword Tool to find out the variations. We have made sure that the keyword should have the word "unlock" or "refurbished." That way, we have refrained to get the clicks from those visitors who want the brand new phones because we only sell the Refurbished ones. The ad copies was written accordingly, but in the ad copies we have tried to use the minimum pricing of the product that we are selling. Means if we are selling the refurbished iPhone 14, we have mentioned the minimum price for that product. That way we have been able to filter out those visitors who cannot afford the product even at that lowest price. So as you can imagine, the quality of the clicks that we have got was very relevant, and that's how we was able to see the conversions or the sales coming in from the first month itself. The other challenge for this client. was the brand name they don't had any brand name that is actually known to the visitors and they had a bigger brand names in the competition in that market so we have done some videos for them we have done the youtube campaigns for the branding purpose and we have done the remarketing campaigns for the add to cart maintenance and giving them like 5% off coupon code because most of the times that the visitor who leaves the website from the add to cart page the pricing is a major factor so we have tried to do the remarketing for the add to cart abandoners and we did saw a good amount of sales from that strategy for this client the demographic targeting played a very important role what we have seen was the 18 to 24 visitors they all they were only doing the research but they were not buying the product because they don't have the money needed to buy the product so what we have done was we have colored those age ranges like 18 to 24 and and then 65 plus so by doing that we were able to save some dollars and those spend that we have saved over there those was allocated to other age ranges which were bringing us the sales at a better roas this is how we were able to control the spend so that we only spend the higher amount on the best converting areas similarly what we have seen was the computers traffic that is the desktop traffic was actually having much better roas as compared to the mobile phones so we have separated out the campaign for computers and then separate campaign for the mobile phones and that's how we were able to see better sales at much better roas so we have started working with them in the middle of the last year around june or july at that time they were having the revenue of almost 
hundred or five thousand dollars. Last month they had the revenue of almost three hundred thousand dollars with the ROAS of. 10.48 so the client is very happy a few months ago we have already started on the facebook side of things and in the coming months we are looking to do the ads on the microsoft side of things as well thanks for watching the video please do like share and subscribe and don't forget to click the bell icon